and make some noise for Mr. Could have kept that going a little bit, but hey, I, I understand. You got it. seatbelts. <laughs> ah, man. Uh, I got some family here tonight. Uh, Y'all gonna hear some things uh, that you might not used to hearing me say, but hey, it is what it is. Uh, Jace got him in the building. First of all, let me start off by saying it's hard being a big black dude. It's hard. Just ask my man that just came off the stage. Because a lot of people think that we just do shit, you know, like, I had people come up to me and hand me keys. Like, I'm the security guy. <laughs> like, if I stand outside right now, I guarantee two people will come up to me and ask for directions. <laughs> and it's nothing better than getting them keys to a car and then driving it. But <laughs> like, yeah, I'm gonna bring it back. I'm gonna bring it back. I work in the public school system, AKA the zoo. <laughs> if you've never been to any public school system, I suggest you go and substitute teach one day. And I don't know what it is about black people, but black people in the education system are not mixing right now. I seen a parent come get their child one day, I'm not even making this shit up. A woman came and got her kid, now mind you, she had on some footies, some SpongeBob pajama pants and a tank top with her titties exposed. And this was 2.30 in the afternoon. Like, you ain't got no job. And she had a tattoo on her chest that said ratchet. And it wasn't even in good penmanship. It was like an Indian ink jailhouse tattoo. And she came in and came about her kids and just cussing. Where my mother kid at? Where my mother daughter at? Oh, I'm like, I start cussing with her. I don't know where your mother kid at. I go help find the little mother daughter. <laughs> and these names, these names that black people are coming up with, I, I don't know. I don't know. You can't even Google the shit. It's just crazy. And I met this one little girl. Her name was Alea Day. Last name Day. First name Alea. I said, that's your name? She said, yeah. I got a cousin named Another Day. Another Day? <laughs> it's like 8 o'clock in the morning. I'm, I'm too sober for this shit. But I ran out to the car, got me some Hennessy, and it made sense. <laughs> met a little dude named Chaos. Now see, if your name is Chaos, you have to live up to that name. You feel me? Like you have to, like if you can't be a stand-up citizen and your name is Chaos. It's like we set these kids up, that's all I'm saying. Met a kid named I Be Good, I Be Good. That's your name, I Be Good. And this, this, is what, this is what pretty much did it for me. One day, <laughs> one day I met a little fourth grader and his name was Jesus. Some of y'all say, no, nah, black people especially, no, nah, his name's Jesus. No, nah, his name was Jesus. <laughs> and he had a sister named Heavenly. And guess who was in trouble every single day? Little Jesus. I go to the bus stop, I hear the bus driver, she's like, Jesus, sit down. Jesus, stop chewing on the seat. Jesus, stop eating the paper. Jesus, stop smacking people. I'm like, the Messiah is here in fourth grade? Let me 
check my Bible. He's supposed to be here today. 